if I look back on my uh, career and happened to be like when I started, it's this like, you know, end of Web 1. What did happen in Web 1? Web 1, we digitized information and fairly structured information, world information in a structured manner. Web 2, we digitized payments, social interactions, conversations, content in kind of structured, unstructured manner. But today, something magical is happening. We're actually digitizing reality. Now, what does that mean? Computation, it's both cognitive computation, um, spatial computing, you heard the term from uh, anyone, the uh, watched the Apple's, the uh, WWDC last week, they talked about the era of spatial computing. And here we talk a lot about decentralized, the, the um, distributed computing, right? All those combined help us to sum summon and digitize the environment around us, the time around us, the space around us. Um, it also allows machines to think, feel, see. The perception technologies over the years have advanced significantly. All those help us to have a digital realm that's more physics-based, more realistic. And I think the most magical thing that is happening is how we interact with, how we command that information. Think about this through eye projection, voice, gesture, movements. We can interact with that digital reality. And that free up the amount of imagination that we have as business people, as community leaders, how we could enhance our physical life better through this magical interaction, almost real interaction with a virtual world. So virtual over physical. 